Alright, hi! Next part of Let's Play Umineko Legend of the Golden Witch. Oh, so the boat eventually did slow down. Battler's looking relieved. Stop trying to grope your cousin. What drinks? I'm just imagining Hideyoshi, Rudolph, Kyrie, and Eva, oh, and Rosa just rolling around on the floor laughing at Battler. It is a, it is a, an amazing image. <laughs> think of something harmless. Think of something. You better not start talking about her chest again. Seriously, Battler. Enough is enough. Oh, just about her parents. Unfortunately, they're fine. Battler's got got it. He is the best. Epic redirect. Battler got pissed at how quickly his father remarried after uh, his mother's death. I'm sorry I can't say anything funny about this, but this is basically just exposition. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, we figured that out, Battler. <laughs> Battler, high class gentleman. I think that speaks for itself. I'm not going to say anything about this because I don't want to step on anyone's toes. What's gone? is a, uh, I think it's a small shrine. I think this is probably a good, good time to show off the pause screen. This is that character sheet I was talking about. We've currently got sprites for all of the cousins. Five of the parents out of seven total, and space. Oh, and uh, Kamisawa. We have space for the rest of the servants who are connected by a blue line, and the rest of the family who are all connected by red lines. And Nanjo over here who has no lines. Uh, there's also tips, which is not full yet, and these, the uh, grimoires, which basically tell you about stuff. Yeah, Tori is a ceremonial entry gate to a Shinto shrine, and the word tutelary god was uh, the god of a region. The other things were a uh, little thing about western names, that Namu Namu Namu, and Jessica's speech. One sec, let me save. That's how you save. Anyway, uh, it's time for me to stop recording, so see you next time.